All right, going to test the closed loop uh, version of the 9 quart air conditioner. Uh, this one here obviously is closed loop. You don't need a drain on this one. But if you want to add ice, you can run a, a drain through the port. So uh, this is for the water. Oops, got to turn our inverter on here. There we go. It's for the water. And you can see the movement. Let me see if I can stop it. Uh, you might not be able to see it. It's kind of hard to see. So when you pinch it, well, there you go. When you pinch it, that's how you know your uh, water is flowing because you're cutting it off. So we have a closed loop system. Uh, so, and we've got the fan control here. So let's close this rascal. This is really crude just for design purposes and we'll turn the fan on. It takes the uh, closed loop version to get uh, cold. It takes it a little longer. I've been uh, probably had the ice in there with the copper tubing for about five minutes without running it, but I can tell it's already colder. They don't generally, uh, off, right off the bat, get as cold as fast as an open loop version, but this is cold already. I'm going to slow it down to, uh, I know a lot of people, it sounds louder on the video than it really is, like if you were in van life or something, so I'm going to turn it down as if you were running it uh, inside so the open loop version the ice melted after 15 minutes and it cooled for another 30 minutes i mean another 15 minutes so that's 30 minutes running on high and low and the water was still cold and it was still blowing cold and remember that when your ice melts the water's still cold and there's two, there's kind of a caveat if you want to uh, do one of two things if you use a drain plug on your cooler to let the ice water uh, the excess water uh, flow out or drain then the air will be colder but the ice won't last the cold the, I guess it'll be colder for the length of time that it runs but if you don't drain it it'll be cold but not as cold longer so it's kind of a caveat whichever one you want to do but anyway we're gonna sign off here and this is uh, James again with cold school and I'm just gonna test this uh, closed loop version and see how long the ice melts in it and it's just a little tiny tiny little uh, paint bucket all right y'all have a great day bye bye